Okay, this was the dead out, and I'm gonna show you the slime out, but see, I'll show you what happens underneath all this. See all those high beetle larvae? See all the high beetles down there just doing their thing? So they're just down there reproducing, having a good old time. Look at them. I'm about to rock their world. Let me show you what, what I kind of like to do. I'm not recommending anybody do this, but I found it to be successful. In a true slime out, usually there's not all this yellow powder pollen right here like this. Usually they're just might be thousands of larvae just squirming around and slime everywhere. This hive is not really a slime. It's just kind of, maybe it's already past that stage. I don't know, but I like to take my blowtorch and just burn them. They can't stand the heat. Get a couple of these here there, but there really aren't any bees left in here. So I mainly just killing beetles and larvae. So I just do this. This works really well if you got like, you don't have this yellow pollen stuff in here. You get right to the larvae better. Just cook them a little bit. But this way you know they're dead. It's really not a big deal trying to take them anywhere, get rid of them. Just you know they're not going to fall out on the ground and turn into beetles. It really works well. How about that? It kills them instantly when it hits them. But you do have to, in this situation, I do have to turn it over so they're exposed. As you can see. See how it just, it just nails them, hammers them. Beetles and larvae alike. It just, they can't tolerate it. I couldn't either if I was in this situation, I'm sure. The frames are not in really bad shape. I'm going to leave the boxes out here. And the next week when we do splits, I'll put them on top of deeps to kind of help manage the room. So my busier colonies, maybe that's what I'm planning on doing. So that's one strategy. If you come into a slime out, you got high beetles and high beetle larvae everywhere, you can just burn them with a the torch. They do not tolerate heat very well at all.